like to introduce you to a young friend of mine, Selena. I mean, we've been criticised on the channel for not showing enough ladies who play the game. Well, let me assure you um, that Selena has come to me. She's already had a couple of lessons and she's gone away, hopefully practising what I'm asking her to do. And now we're just doing a review on, on what she's learnt so far. We've looked at the stands, where to hold the queue, where to place the bridge. And I noticed that one or two things, that she's made her own adjustments, which I'm going to tell her off for, to be honest, as we carry on. I mean, she put a little bit of tape on a, on a queue here where I used to put a pencil mark, and that's going to inhibit her progress, to be honest. But anyway, what we're going to do is just have a look at what she's done so far, and then we'll take it from there. Okay, Selena, so can I just you, ask you to pot a few balls. Don't worry if you miss, it does not matter at all, yeah? If the white is in a position where you find it a little bit awkward, don't worry again, just move the damn thing, okay? Not a problem. Okay, love, away you go, and I'll just be watching your technique. So just try to pot red and colour, red and colour. As I say, it doesn't matter if you miss. Good, very good. <coughs> unlucky, unlucky. I just move the white if you need to, love, it's not a problem. We're just looking at technique for the moment. Okay, it's all right. Good. It's oh, all right. Good. Let's try that one over there. Love. Play for the blue in this into this pocket. Good. Now, can I just stop you there? Don't you find that tape there rubs on your bridge here? Yeah? yeah, it does. Right, well, well, we'll correct that in a moment, okay? okay thank you. Good. Well, the basic idea is there, it's coming along nicely. Takes time, doesn't it? Mm, it does, definitely. Right, just stop there at the cue ball now. Just stop at the cue ball. Just stay still for me. Right. Now, one of the things that's happening here, Selena, with your stance is that you're, if you turn your head towards me now, you're leaning backwards. That's, good. you know, if I look at the angle of this rear leg, stay there. If I look at this angle of this rear leg now, yeah, we're mm -hmm. tending to slope backwards. So what I like to see is the weight going forward a little bit onto the table. So if you just think of moving your feet back and lean into the shot, just marginally, away you go. That's better, yeah? Mm. You get what I mean? Yeah. Now you're more stable. The weight's going forward mm. rather than backwards. Right, just want to have a look at your overall position again, Selena. So if you can, I'm going to just take a measurement of where that tape is okay. there. Because I think you've moved it away from the mark I put on, haven't you? Mm, eh? I think it should be further up, I think. Yeah. I think right, just get far. down as though you're going to pop the blue. We'll have a look at that stance. Pretty good there, Selena. Not bad at all. That's a good bridge. Although the heel of the hand is off the table, which can encourage the, the hand to rock. So if you can get the hand... That's better. Good girl. Now just turn the hand to the right a little bit. Just turn, no, turn the whole hand like that, all marginally, only a little, and that gives you a nice V. And when this belly here 
gets in the way, you know, just turn the hand to the right and it's, it's out the way, mm -hmm. okay? Right, stay there. Right, let's have a look at that measurement. Right, well, we're 12 and a quarter inches to the knuckle, which is, a, to be honest, a little excessive, mm -hmm. all right? So I'm going to move that, with your permission, of course. Yeah, yeah, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm going to make that, I think, 10 and a half inches. Mm -hmm. Now, I'm going to take this tape off, because that... I'm, I'm, <laughs> just hold your hand out like that. Don't do things like that. <laughs> That's right. why I've got to use uh, my coach, that's why. <laughs> oh <dear. laughs> Got to have a bit of fun while we learn. Oh yeah, we? definitely. Uh, right, so we don't just get down again now. Okay. And we're going to use that mark mm -hmm. for where your, cue, okay. where your bridge goes, all right? Yep. So we cue to the ball, move your hand forward, so that is it. Now you'll feel as though you're a little bit cramped up because you've been used to be it being here yeah and now i've moved you a good inch and a half okay. forward yeah yeah so just stay there don't move little kink in that arm now that's good at the front let's have a look here now you keep looking forward for me selena good girl now let this hand come forward just a fraction right keep looking forward now that's a much better position now this distance here between your hand and your body, that's going to transfer to the front. You're right? Mm -hmm. So we come forward there. And now don't move your bridge arm, so we go there. And now that has become your follow through. Mm -hmm. Okay? Very, very important. Right. So the mark that I've put on here, you've still retained that, haven't you? Looks like. Yeah, I've and that's quite good. <laughs> but with you altering that position, yeah. You've invalidated the value of this, mm. you know? Right, so let me just have your cue for a second. Now, what I want, if you come round there, <clears throat> right, so your hand is on that mark, the front of the hand, mm -hmm. and you're on this mark here. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. now we get down, and we can play the shot from there. Now, mm. if this cue ball happens to be here, we're on that mark still, mm -hmm. We can't get on that mark, right? So we have to move forward where we, where we need to put mm. it to play the shot. Make a judgment of how far you've gone forward of this mark, mm. right? And then move this hand forward the same amount. Oh, okay. So what we're looking at is there is the relationship between the two hands, right? When we're playing a normal shot, mm. right? If we have to move that, that hand, we move this one the same. So the relationship between the two hands is fairly constant. Mm. Do you get me? Mm. It's very important, mm. you know? Okay, so I, with your permission, I'm gonna put that mark on a little bit more pronounced. Okay, all right? yeah, so, that's great. Because when you're rubbing a, along it like that, you're gonna rub it off. Oh yeah, definitely. So what yeah, I've got here is a permanent marker. We can, yeah. If you want it off at any time, <sighs> All you need is a little bit of nail varnish That'll remover and it's gone. At least it's there, it's not going away. Yeah, <laughs> so we'll put this on. Right, a little bit more pronounced than what it was for you. All right. Yeah. Thank you. And, uh, okay, that's fine. So now, front of the hand mm -hmm. and your knuckle of your bridge hand. Yeah, okay? at least I can see it better as well. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> right, let's see how we go. Okay. Down you go. That's lovely. I like that. Good. Stay there. Good. Good. Let this hand come forward onto your mark, remember? Good. Now do your preparation and play the shot. Good girl. Right. Not bad at all. Right. I'm happy with that. Now we're going to have a look at that grip because that's very important. Right. Now, most people struggle with the grip, you know, because it's different. Can mm. I ask you just to pull your sleeve up yeah. a little bit? Good girl. Right, that, that'll be lovely. Right. Just hold it. We'll forget the mark for now. Okay. Just get, hold it where you like, because I'm conscious of the ceiling. Yeah. <laughs> right. <laughs> so, 
if you watch the top boys on television, watch Ronnie, Sean Murphy, um, shall we say Neil Robertson, people like that, John Higgins, this area here, mm -hmm. between that knuckle and that knuckle, this mm -hmm. fleshy bit here, when they're playing the shot on the backswing, they'll, you'll find that the cue nestles into that. Mm. And that controls the wrist, okay? Mm. So what I like to do now is get a person to make a circle there with mm. their forefinger and thumb, concentrating on this area here. So when they take the cue back, it's into there. Now, so we just hold that, that cue with a full grip, but concentrating on these... Mm. this area this this front of the hand so all i'm going to do is push the cue into that web of flesh just hold that with your left hand for me selena good now try and relax good now these fingers mm. never lose contact with the cue they're always in contact mm. but you see how we're dominant here mm -hmm. this is your constant so i want you to feel these three points one mm. on the cue two finger and thumb yeah and this third finger so we've got one two three mm -hmm. now if we just put that into the cueing position just hold it there with your left hand right so mm -hmm. i'm coming around there look we'll come back now stop there for me mm -hmm. one this point here two finger and thumb mm -hmm. three the third finger now we play the shot the hand closes the body goes, the hand goes up towards the body mm -hmm. and we've played the shot. You get what I mean? Yeah. Uh, relax and close. Relax and close. Now, without a ball, just see if you can do that on the table for me. Okay. All right, just, just here, across the table's fine. There, that's good. Good. Right, now just relax. Good, stay there. One, two, three. Now this part of the hand here, this heel of the hand is not touching the cue. Mm -hmm. Now when we play the shot, the heel of the hand comes to the cue. No, Are you with yeah. me? Yeah. Good girl. Lovely. Now let's get in the right position now. So you're on your mark at the back. Come on, let go. Come back to your chalk. <laughs> there, that's good. Right, now get on your, on your mark at the front. Good. Right, away you go, Selena. Backwards and forwards. Good, good, well done. Right, now what we're gonna do now is just imagine you're gonna play a shot. So there we are, we're in the position, the cue, the cue tips at the cue ball, right? So we point the cue, we're one and two and three. Wait, play the shot, all right? Mm -hmm. So again, one and two and three, wait. Play the shot, all right? Mm -hmm. Right, I'm just going to give you the white ball. I don't want you to aim for anything other than the cushion. Okay. Right, don't aim for the pocket because then I've got to go and fetch it. <laughs> <laughs> right, so just point the cue at the cushion. Wait for me. Right, here we go. Are you comfy? Yeah. Right, here we go then. One and two and three. Wait, play the shot. Good girl. Right, just get, try and get through the ball a little more than you are doing. Mm -hmm. You should be about there, okay. all right? Here we go again then. Right, point, no, let me move that. Going to be on you, check your mark on the knuckle. Yeah. We're on the mark here, are we? I'm Relax. That go. Now, <laughs> just relax this hand. I would not like that hand round my neck. Come on, <laughs> relax, relax. Come on, that's better. Good girl. Right, here we go. Now point the cue. One and two and three. Wait, play the shot. Beautiful. Good girl. Couple times.